All right, Citrap, we are in hangar six of the Echo Delta Foxtrot Echo uh, Eaglesbach Airfield. Uh, this is the uh, 430 WAS unit of November uh, 98825. Um, those are the two data cards that contain um, the data for uh, the GPS. The right one, that is the terrain data, and the left one is the one we are going to pull, the one with the actual nav data information ah! so that slides right out here of the gps and that is the the correct card that is uh uh yeah it says nav data on it instead of terrain data and it's one that is for um uh it has a bigger capacity because it's for the was unit and as i explained yesterday that goes into this card reader thing and all the while uh, my notebook is of course connected via uh, 3, 3G and uh, now I'm just going to do the same thing that I couldn't do at home yesterday. So I have our aircraft selected. We have the um, uh, the cycle 1705 and I'm starting the uh, the transfer now and as you can see now it says 16 megabyte card was and there's no longer this incompatible thing here that we saw yesterday so i click continue and now it'll download from the from the jeppesen server the um uh, the current nav data and then flash it onto this device here so as you can see it's a seven and a half megabyte download and uh, we are in the hangar now so i don't know how good the the 3G reception is here, so maybe that, that'll that take a while. Um, maybe I shouldn't drag the notebook outside for for better reception. Uh, yeah, this is not really going fast. So yeah, this is a 172P. Uh, from the 80s that I do most of my instructing on and I guess I'm going to pause the video right here and come back when the when the download is finished <laughs> 